for the thrill of the game. Okay, so what I have is a GeForce GTX 260 graphics card. Um, I'm going to upgrade soon, but I want to see what I can push out of this one. You'll notice that there's these are the exhaust vents at the back. <coughs> Actually, they're not exhaust vents at all. They're intake ports for air. This fan pulls air in, goes over top of the heat sink, and then pushes it out here. So what I've developed is this tunnel and these two fans that push just over 9 cubic feet per minute of air. So this tunnel will attach to the back of the graphics card and these fans which will plug into the motherboard will sit on the back like that. So there will be a high pressure of air in here, cold air, because these are going to be sitting right up against the back of one of the fans in my case. You can see, you can't see, it's fine. But So I'm going to be porting the air into the exhaust vents here. What's up guys, Zebu City here. Follow up for the uh, Polarian Invention graphics card mod. After testing on Battlefield 3 Metro Map 64 player um, server, the overall temperature of the graphics card that's been overclocked from stock 666 MHz core up to 730 MHz is down 5 degrees in temperature, which is pretty good in my opinion um, for $25 worth of materials and an hour of my time. 